Hey Pisces, welcome back to the channel guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Pisces, what is this love thing all about, baby? Sex in the city oracle. Let's see. Wow, Pisces, loyal hearts. Loyal hearts and you have an engagement dinner. Let's see. What is coming towards Pisces? If you're not already in it, what is coming towards Pisces? In love, spirit. Past, present, or future, though, right? Don't be surprised, Pisces. Oh, yeah. oh Pisces. Remember when I just split the deck and it was loyal hearts? Well, guess what, baby? Loyal hearts. And it's plural. So, Pisces, you and your person are both loyal, right? You're, you're both loyal. What's going on with these loyal hearts? Holy Spirit for Pisces. I didn't know what love was until I met you. Pisces. Pisces. They didn't know what love was until they met you. They have a loyal heart, Pisces, just like yours. Isn't that special? Holy Spirit for Pisces. Taking a walk on the beach, Pisces. They just want to walk on the beach with you, hold your hand, have a good time. Look at this, Pisces. Take a vacation. If you live near a beach, then you just go to the beach, right? Um, and they want the world to know that they love you, Pisces. <laughs> Pisces. What's going on here? Loyal hearts. Taking a walk on the beach. They didn't know what love was, so they met you, Pisces. And now they want the world to know that they love you. Really? Let's see. Pisces, this person could have a lot of anxiety right now, right? They have, could be having a lot of dreams, a lot of illusions. Something ended in, ended in this person's life, a shattered dream. Could be a broken family, could be a struggling relationship. But although they got knocked down, Pisces, they're still ambitious. So something ended in this person's life. Maybe they're coming to you. They're very action oriented and they're very driven to succeed, Pisces. They're defending their beliefs. Pisces, this could be you, the Nine of Pentacles here, somebody who you know, luxury, self-sufficient, financially independent. Either that or that's who this Pisces is going to. Or Pisces, this is what's coming towards you. You could be this person. And your person could be rushing in, Pisces. Your person could be rushing in, Pisces. Pis. Pisces, whoever this person is, they're doing a lot of soul searching, doing a lot of thinking, spending a lot of time alone, meditating. Yeah, something ended in this person's life. They're, they're, it was like a lot of information overload, but they're choosing the lesser of two evils. And although they want to rush into you, Pisces, they want to rush in. They're still having a lot of negative thoughts or they're basically stopping themselves from coming forward, like a little fear. Uh, they feel kind of trapped a little bit, but in their own head. They're kind of trapped in their own head about coming forward, maybe possibly after this ending. Pisces, they could be fighting over you. A little competition here. Whoever this person is walking away from, maybe they got wind about you, Pisces, because there's some conflict there, some disagreement, some tension, some rivalry. They could be fighting over you, fighting over somebody, Pisces. Pisces, they want this partnership with you. This is a choice. That they're making like they're making this choice the strength of two is what it says and 
Pisces, whoever they're walking away from, this person has a lack of commitment. They could be very lazy. Um, they could have procrastinated with you. But Pisces, you're going to learn from this. You're learning from this. Right. And there it is, Queen of Swords in reverse. They could be walking away from a very bitchy person, cold-hearted, cruel, jealous. This person could also be easily influenced. Pisces, your person that's trying to get to you because they're fighting, because of this rivalry, somebody, whoever they're walking away from feels that you were their competition. So they're creating all these extra burdens for this person, Pisces. It's like um, the Ten of Wands. It's like they're coming to the end of it. It's been a lot of hard work, but it's the Ten of Wands. Spirit, clarify this Queen of Swords in reverse. Yeah, it's a lot of disharmony with this person. They feel like they're working alone, Pisces. There's no teamwork. It's disorganized. It's conflict. Spirit, clarify this nine of pentacles upright. That was a lost opportunity. So, Pisces, this is you. They feel like they lost you. And that's what they want back. You're a very uh, self-sufficient person, Pisces. Very financial independent. You got your own doing your own thing. But they're dealing with somebody who's lazy and procrastinates and lack of commitment. So this person, Pisces, is learning from their failure. So they're like, look, do I stay with Lucy Goosey who's lazy and don't want to get out of the damn bed? Or do I want to go to this Pisces, somebody who's living the fruits of their labor, right? They self-sufficient by their damn self, right? So that's their choice. Do they want this lazy person or do they want to go get her? That's the choice. If I had to choose, I'm going for the go-getter. Don't nobody want no lazy-ass person. That's like trying to get your kid up out the bed when they're 14. Don't nobody want that. Nobody wants a grown-ass child that just sits around and watch movies da -da 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 all day. Mind you, I do watch movies. However, I work about 18 hours a day every day. <laughs> I ain't even playing. Okay, 12. 14. I work about 14 hours a day. So if I had to choose, if this was me, I, I couldn't be with a lazy person either because if I'm all over the place and I'm working and I'm making things happen, Pisces, you don't want nobody just sitting around. That's like cleaning the house. Like I'm cleaning and then everybody's just sitting around. No, I don't need you to watch me clean. I'm not your maid. You know what I mean? I don't, don't watch me clean. Either you can get your ass up and help me. <laughs> Get the hell out that room. I don't like that. I don't like that when you see people cleaning and people don't help. No. Leave my house and let me do what I do. Mm -hmm. Pisces. You're walking away from something. And you're going to a loyal, a loyal heart. It'll be two loyal hearts together. Pisces Spirit said you need to take action because that could damn well be your happy well. That could damn well be your happy family. That's the rainbow, Pisces. But you got to take action. And it looks like you are, Pisces. Go ahead, Pisces. Take your action. See what you got to do. See what you got to do. This is a thinking man. So they're definitely thinking about it. Pisces, they're coming towards you. This person's coming. They're going to take action so they can have this happy family with that go-getter over there. Mm -hmm. The cornucopia. I told you, Pisces, somebody's coming back for you. It's the woman holding the coin. Pisces, you're the woman holding the coin. They appreciate you, Pisces. But this person right now, just like with these conflicts here, they, they're dealing with some hostilities. They're dealing with some hostilities because they're walking away. Mm-hmm. Pisces, somebody's coming to get you. Yeah, they're coming to get you, Pisces, and they're taking action, and they want the world to know that they love you. So you have a loyal heart coming in, Pisces. Just saying. Let's see how this person is feeling about Pisces. Holy Spirit from a Pisces. Give me a bay message, Spirit. Don't ever take your love away, Pisces. One more Spirit for Pisces. And thank you for loving me. You changed me. 
I see you changed this person. And I think it said that up there with the blue card. I just can't quite remember what it said. It says, I didn't know what love was until I met you. Pisces, you changed them. I didn't know what love was until I met you. And then thank you for loving me. You changed me. Mm -mm -mm. And Pisces, they're just fighting right now. They're fighting with whoever this person is, the Queen of Swords in reverse, who's bitchy, easily influenced. Maybe they listen to somebody. I don't know. But this person is cold-hearted. There was no teamwork. It was like... Whoever this person was that you was dating or whoever's coming to you, Pisces, it, they felt like they were in this connection all by themselves with a lazy person, with a lazy ass. But with you, Pisces, you're a little go-getter, right? You, you on it. You're this and that. You're self-sufficient. You got your luxuries. You got this. You got that. You got whatever. And you're loyal. So it's two loyal hearts coming together. And eventually, you're going to be walking on the beach together. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. That's what the card says. I didn't make it up. Peace.